probably the biggest mistake most people make is they want, like everything, the very cheapest they can get, which of course is important. And there's a lot of advertisements on TV now with different carriers that advertise low rates. Uh, but the biggest thing they do is they, they don't get the proper coverages because they leave those out in order to get the rate reduced. Most people who carry a $50,000 property damage limit, which up till a few years ago was probably really adequate. But now there's so many new vehicles that are over seventy, eighty thousand dollars $80,000 that that doesn't cover the damages anymore. Say for instance, you hit and damage a brand new Suburban that's $76,000 with a $50,000 property damage limit, they're going to pay the $50,000 and you're going to get a bill for the other $26,000 to replace that vehicle. And so a lot of people assume because they have full coverage, it's going to take care of that completely. And so that's kind of a misnomer that we're trying to help people understand that you need to have an adequate amount for the cost of these new vehicles.